Hello, everybody. Welcome to Voices Big and Small. On this episode, I'm going to be um, profiling New York-based voice actor Jimmy Zoppy, also known as James Carter Cathcart, or also known as Carter Cathcart, or also known as Billy Beach. Many of you would probably remember, you know, know his work, know him best from his work on Pokemon as the voice of Gary Oak from season one on, as well as um, the voices of the English voices of Meowth and, and James from season nine on. So without no further ado, let's take a look and get to know um, Jimmy Zoppy a little bit here. Um, James Carter Cathcart, often credited as Carter Cathcart or Jimmy Zoppy, is an American voice actor, voice director, pianist, and vocalist. He has been playing with bands since high school, including The Laughing Dogs, who released two albums on Columbia in 1979-80. Wow, so he's a musician going all the way far back. According to this, he started in his acting career as far back as 81. Of course, we're just going to focus on his like anime and game work primarily. So, um, anyways. And has been a vocalist of the Carter Cathcart band since 1981. Cathcart um, also co-wrote the song Remember Me with Kiss guitarist Ace Freely um, that ended up on Freely's 1989 Solo album Trouble Walking. Wow, that's in that's interesting. He actually has a song that Ace Freely did on his solo album. Just goes to show you when you look into people a little bit, what you can find out, huh? Okay, so moving on, it um. Zoppy's first voiceover part was O.G. Readmore on the ABC Weekend Special. Wow, I even I didn't know that. That was, I grew up, I grew up back in those days. That was back in the eighties. I didn't know he didn't even dawn on me. You know, in later years that was him. Wow. After that, he recorded voiceovers for Kit Kat candy bars, Good Humor, Coors Light, and others. Jimmy Zoppy later auditioned in voice acting and, and has since become known for a prolific amount of anime dub voice work for Central Park Media, Media Blasters, Do Art Film, and Video, Taj Productions, and YAV Post, and once had multiple roles in many shows for kids' entertainment. He currently voices James and Meowth in Pokemon. And I said, probably the... the role he's most, most known for. Is, uh, the work he's probably most known for is work on Pokemon. Okay, so here are some of his anime credits. In 1996, he was cast um, in the Central Park Media dub of Here's Greenwood. Here's Greenwood. <laughs> anime as the English voices of Masato Ikeda and Mr. Ikeda. He was then also cast in um, I guess I have to look this up a little bit here because so he's apparently so just to, I'm just checking something here in terms of He was in a, he was in Bach, according to this in 1996, he was also cast as the English voice of Baki Hamna and Mitsunari Tokugawa in Grappli, Grappler Baki, the Ultimate Fighter. Only thing is, from what I recall, I know from, this may be a different dub, obviously, that's, I gotta check something out with it. Because I know Funimation did a dub of it. 
you know, um, with Chris Bevins as the voice of, oh yeah, this, this is an OVA, this is the OVA, let's see, see who, who actually did this OVA, who, who was the ones who, dubbed. this is the OVA, um, Funimation did the, um, Funimation did the TV series. This is the OVA. And it was licensed by Central Park Media. So basically this was, so this Grappler, Grappler Baki was the um, Central Park Media dub of the OVA. Of the OVA of Grappler Baki Ultimate Fighter. So. So, oh, moving on, and that happened in 1996, of course. Then, as we move up here, and also in 1996, he was cast as a number of English voices in in Slayers, most notably as Prince Philonel L. D. Serum. That that was his. That was probably his most famous voice on Slayers, but also he was. Dilgear, Varumagun, the innkeeper, um, shopkeeper's wife, um, shaman, Zor Zoram, bandit B, wizard, and thief. So uh, he obviously voiced a bunch of a bunch of characters, but primarily his main ones and slayers were Prince F Philanol, um, L D. Shayrun, um, Dilgear, Ver and Varumgun. In battle in 1997, he was cast as English voice of Fofi in Battle Arena Toshiden. Also, in the 1997 animated movie Art of Fighting, he was cast as English voice of Ryu Hako Toto. Then in 1998, he was cast as the English voice of Miki Kaoru as revolu in Revolutionary Girl Utena. And then here we go. Um, as I said, probably his most famous works are from, are of course from Pokemon. And from the first season of Pokemon back in 1998, he was, well, they even say here he was cast as Meowth and James, but I think he more took over those roles later on. Um, but also, um, there was a point in time he was Professor Oak, Gary Oak, um, Maze Much Munchlight. So these are all the roles that he's done throughout all the Pokemon series. Price, Johto Gym Leader, Cleavon, um, Spielbunk. Um, James's Carnivine, Kurt, Butch, Mr. Sukizo, Mr. Charles Goodshow, Todd Snap, Mr. Briny, Kaburagi, and Johto, um, Ashes Swellow, Ashes Torkoal, Professor Rowan, Dr. Namba, Ashes Torterra, he had a bunch of different uh, Pokemon voices too. Ash's Grottle, Ash's Turtwig, Ash's Palpitoad, Cal from Sinnoh, Captain Marius Johto. And I'm trying to be a little quieter here, you guys, just only because it's a little later at night than I'm normally recording. And you know, other people in my house obviously trying to sleep, so I'm trying to not be quite as loud. So I hope you guys can still hear me um, as I'm doing this. Um, Carney from Sinnoh, Evian from Canto Battle Frontier, Gongo from Johto, um, Infernando in Johto, Jack Pollockson in Johto, bunch of Johto characters, Kenzo from Johto, the mayor of Trovotropolis. I think that was a guy who was trying to, <laughs> who wanted Pokemon trainers to go in there and get rid of all the, um, I guess, the, 
uh, Ven the Bobo shows and Venus shows that had clogged up their sewers. Mo from Kanto, Myron from Johto, Old Man Sh Old Man Shuckle. Basically, he uh, basically had a lot of characters and you know, but his primary characters in in Pokemon, of course, were as Gary Oak, Meowth, and James. He had a, and then in the Pokemon Snap video game in 1999, he was of course reprised his role as Todd Snap. And then in Slayer's Next, he would reprise his role, of course, as Prince Phil, in um in Slayer's as well as um, being cast in English voices, Demia, Bandit Boss, Chef, and Dragon Cuisine Master. In, uh, in, in a Pokemon short, he would also reprise his roles as Meowth and Maze Munchlax. In Pokemon, the first movie in 1999, he was Fergus. He provided the English voice of Fergus. In the Valkyrie Profile video game, he was Badrack and Cashel. And then he would reprise his role as Gary Oak in the Pokemon Puzzle League video game. And then in 2000, that was in 2000. And then in, well, the Valkyrie Pro, two video game roles came in 2000. Then in 2001, he was cast in Ping Pong Club as the English voice of Maeno. And he would reprise his role as Prince Phil in, in Slayer's Try in 2001. In Cubic, he was cast as English voices of Mong and Cerebix. In Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Monsters in 2001, he was cast as the English voices of Weevil Underwood and Loomis. In, in the Shadow Hearts video game, he was cast as the English voice of Roger Bacon. Well, I don't know if that was the English... Well, he was definitely the English voice, but I don't know if that was a dub, though. But anyways, um... In Mattel Legend in 2002, he was cast as English voice of Jam. In Ultimate Muscle in 2002, he was cast as English voice of Kid Muscle's grandpa. Also in 2002, in Kirby Right Back At You, he was cast English voices of Sir Gallant and Chef um, Nagoya. Then in Austin awesome 2002 in Fighting Foodons, he was cast as the English voice of Cinnamonkey. And then we, as we move into 2003 in Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, he was cast as the English voice of Raz, one of the Triceratons, I guess. Then he would reprise his role as Mong in Cubic Showdown in the 2003 um, Cubic Showdown video game in 2003. Also, Two and three in Ape Escape in the Ape Escape Two video game, he was cast as Yuki Yellow Yellow Monkey. Guess that was as the English voice. Then in Sonic X in two thousand three, he was cast as the English voice as a Vector the Crocodile, an officer, and Scientist number one. Then, as we move on to 2004, he was cast in the anime World of Narue as the English voices of Masaki Maruo and Mr. Izuka. I believe Mr. Izuka is one of their teachers in there. So. Then in Nana Seven of Seven, he was in 2004. He was cast the English voice of the mayor. Then in Four Kids Dub of One Piece in 2004, he was cast the English voices of Butchie, Chess, and Chess Marimo. Now I know many of you are just are mostly familiar with Funimation's dub of One Piece, but prior 
to Funimation getting the license to it. Four Kids had the license for a while and were dubbing it for Saturday morning um, showings. And I know there are a few people out there who are not overly happy about that because, of course, the censorship and the direction of the dubbing that they would go. Then in also in two thousand four, um, he was cast in the in the anime Go the Goku Sen, basically about a um, Yakuza heiress whose dream it was to become a a teacher. He was cast in the English voice of Principal Gonzo Shirakawa. And then in the two thousand four video game Yu Gi Oh Capsule Monster Coliseum, he was cast as the English voice of Weevil Underwood. Then in 2004, in the um, in Shura no Toki, in the anime Shura no Toki, anybody out there who likes great fighting animes, I highly recommend this one. It's a very interesting one. It's cast as the English voice of Munanori Yagyu. Um, then as we move into 2005, he was cast in, in the anime Tokyo Mew 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 Power as the English voice of Shinoclon's uh, Tarb. Then he would reprise his role as Vector the Crocodile in the Shadow the Hedgehog video game in 2005. And in 2006, he would in Pokemon he was cast in the in the in the OVA Pokemon, the mastermind of Mirage Pokemon, as Professor Oak, as well as reprising his roles as James and Meowth in that. And in Pokemon Chronicles in 2006, he was he would reprise his role as Gary Oak as as Gary Oak as well as Doctor Namba. Um, and then in 2006, in the One Piece Grand Adventure video game, he was cast as the English voice as Satori. Then in Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, Team Go Getters Out of the Gate in 2006, he would he would be cast in the voice in the role of as the English voice of Gengar. And then in the Pokemon movie Pokemon Ranger and the Temple of the Sea in 2007, he would reprise his roles as the English voices of James and Meowth, as well as being cast as the uh, as the sound effects of Ash's swallow. And then, as we move into two thousand eight in the in the movie um, MP's Wonderland, he's cast in the role in the voice roles of Barnaby, Monty, and Small Sheik. Then later on in 2008, in the in Pokemon: The Rise of Darkrai movie, he would once again, of course, reprise his roles as James and Meowth, as well as Ash's Turtwig. Then in the Super Smash Brothers Brawl video game, he was cast as the as the English voices of Munchlax and Gulpin. Then in Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers of Time and Darkness, he would provide the sound effects for Corefish and Gabite, the English sound effects. Then in the Pokemon movie Pokemon Gir Giratina and the Sky Warrior in 2009, he would of course reprise his roles as James Meowth and Ash's Turtwig. Then he would reprise his role as Corefish in Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers of Sky Beyond Time and Darkness in 2009. Also in 2009, he would be cast, he would once again reprise um, his roles as James and Meowth as well as being Ash's Grottle in Pokemon Arceus and the Jewel of Life. And then in Pokey Park Wii, Pikachu's Adventure video game, he's cast as the, he is obviously cast in, in the, as the 
for the vocal effects of Honor, Gengar, and Gl Glalie. Then in the 2010 movie Animals United, he was cast as Vulture number two. He would then once again reprise his roles as James and Meowth in the movie Pokemon Zora Zora Arc Master of Illusions. Um, he would also reprise his role. He they, over the next few years here, he, he would primarily be reprising his roles as James and Meowth in a number of Pokemon movies, including Pokemon the movie Black Black White Victini and Re Reshiran Zekom in 2011 and 2013, Pokemon the movie Genesect and the Legend Awakened. Then um, in Pokemon Mewtwo Prologue to Awakening in 2014, he would reprise his role as Professor Oak. Then he would once again reprise his roles, of course, as James and Meowth in Pokemon the movie um, Deonsi and the Cocoon of Destruction. And once again for Hoopa and the Clash of Ages, as well as Volcani in 2015 and then 2016 for the Pokemon the movie Volcanion and the Me Mechanical Marvel. All these, he's basically just reprising his roles as James and Meowth. Um, then in Pokemon the movie I Choose You, he would reprise his roles as James Meowth and Professor Oak. And then starting in 2018, that's when he got involved in um, in the um, Headline Sound Studios dub of Aria, the An Aria series, Aria the Animation. Um, in 2018, he would uh, provide, he would be cast in the English voice of um, Udo Aya, Kano Aya no Koji the 51st. Also in 2018, in Pokemon the movie The Power of Us, he would reprise his role as, roles as James and Meowth. And then in 2019, he would be cast the English voices of Daddy Bloom and Incognito in Tall Tales from the Magical Garden of Antu Kings. That was a movie. Then he would reprise his role as Udo Ayano. Koji the 51st and Aria the Natural in 2019. Um, and this year, he he has a few roles that have come up this year. Um, he continues the role of uh, Udo Ayakonoji the 51st in Aria the OVA Arietta, um, as well as Aria the Origination. And then comes back in Pokemon the movie Mewtwo Strikes Back Evolution. And what looks like more of a computer animated movie this time, reprising the roles of Meowth, James, and Fergus. And that's pretty much it. So a lot of his work surrounds, of course, work on Pokemon as James and Meowth. Um, and then a few other things like in Slayers as Prince Phil. You know, um... Basically, if you've ever heard his voice, you, you, you'd you recognize it. He's got a pretty distinctive voice. He, you know, Weevil Underwood and, and Yukio. Um, so, Uda, you know, his mo right now, he's, of course, involved with Aria, the Aria, you know, the job of Aria by Headline Sound Studios. That one's a pretty nice one. I'm currently watching it. I recommend you guys check it out if you get a chance. So anyways, um, with all that being said and done here, um, you guys can check the links below. My Discord's down there. If you want to contact me directly, you can DM me on my Discord. Check out my Discord and join if you'd like. Um, also, I'm still promoting a bunch of different dub companies because, as you guys know, Funimation is not the only game in town. There's other works out there you guys can check out. Um, also... Um, also, I'm still promoting the GoFundMes. As always, guys, never feel like you have to donate. If it's on your heart to do so, and you have the means to, please consider donating. If you, um, if you've already donated, please consider donating again. And if you cannot donate, you can still help out the cause by sharing the link. Because after all, sharing is caring. 
and you never know maybe some of your circle friends may want to check check it out you know um may want to you know may check it out may want to help out so and as always guys um if you like this content please consider liking commenting sharing and subscribing i always look forward to the um conversation with you guys as long as there's something respectful you know i always look i always look forward to the premieres because i hope to get a chance to talk to you guys you know it's you know it's expose you guys to more animes out there to check out and with that i hope i'll see you guys at the premiere on friday and if not i'll see you on monday bye